talking about the implication of uh, that, uh, how the CBN will I, okay, let's not even call it implication this time. Let's, you know, look at it as a big task. The big task is that how can they push in, you know, cash or can they make cash, you know, go round between now and the next election? Because, yes, you talk about the fact that we've seen the impact of um, the previous uh, I mean, be before when the I mean, Supreme Court trial. you say less election, to, is this um, March 11? We're talking or, about March 11. Well, of course, what, this, what are the morning green seclusion how to do with the election coming on the March no, 11? Of course, we're looking at how this has, if the cash crunch has affected, you know, activities, uh, movement, and of course, we also look at the fact that it was intended to cut vote buying. So, now, the Supreme Court has ruled that let this cash be out there. So, can we get this cash out there for people to move around freely you know buy what they want to buy remember everybody was feeling the impact of the fact that uh, you know there was not uh, much enough uh, cash in the circulation but actually like i said earlier at the beginning that this you no know, cash uh, quality design or not design is for a purpose right. and part of it have been achieved then for the money to go back to the it will be a gradual process and the good thing is that not that this morning for the either the the depositors in the bank or they put out on the money, their money mm. have not disappeared or whatever have not gone SBI. It's still their money. But gradually, because we want monetary policy to have more effect when decisions are taken by that is why this thing has been also far part of the decision that they, they took. But I believe that uh, 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 Supreme Court have given order that the two wrong concurrently. Yes, the two wrong concurrently, but you no, know, this bank money are not in their kitchen again. It's not they can't go and withdraw it now today and take it back to their kitchen or take it back to their mm -hmm. bedroom. No, yeah. it's mm -hmm. a gradual process, it will go back to the system, but it will be a gradual process. But the good thing that I told you the implication of what what, what uh, the thing has done in the month of uh, February in terms of our you know, purchase manager in the terms of business activities has slowed down for the first time for almost two uh, you no know, two uh, two straight years, almost twenty four months that we're seeing uh, our no business activities contrasting for below 50 points with about 44.7 uh, this is the first time for more, for me no i've seen it but then also going to the going to the future what is the implication gradually this form will start coming back to the system mm. and also start driving activities again but no, i should not expect anybody to say that between now and the 11th of march you see this money fully it's not possible if mm. we have survived you know before the presidential election i think the, the but if you say gradual i mean i mean give it give and take what period of time are we looking at? The one week, two weeks, three weeks, or one yeah, month? I, 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 I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not a CBS star. Yes, I've seen it. So if no, you're to, just, an not, out, just an outlook of what will play out, what next that the Supreme Court has ruled now, no, that, no. yes, let this money be out there, let it be a legal tender, let people start spending it. Good. Already, see, it's still within the, the coffers of the banks now, mm. not in their kitchen again. Fine, you still your money, you still go back to it, but not the way before you now go and withdraw it and put it. Now, most of them have open account. What you want to achieve? I think it's probably then almost eighty percent of people have achieved because before for you to change your money or to uh, the void to swallow there's account to put your money on the stuff. That means you can have a transaction through that your money is already in your bank. If you want to pay out to somebody now, you can come and withdraw and you can withdraw some you no know, amount of cash to come out from the bank again. These are part of regulation that you can't withdraw more than so so million from the from the counter. I think it's a good uh, decision for me. But what the uh, Supreme Court have done today, I think good me kudos to you know the rule of law, what we call it, rule to our court. For this is a nice one, let's the two together so that the stress, the pressure will come down gradually, the criminals will pick up again. Mm -hmm. Because I believe that you no know, if you're taking in this month of March again we might see another slowdown in business activity because of this uh, you no know, cash crunch. If rather the funds are coming back and we will be bounced back before we enter the second uh, second quarter of the year. For me it's a good one. It's a good policy. The uh, the decision of the Supreme Court is a welcome one. The point the Naira design is a welcome one. For me, it's all good good for what for the economy. I say that we need to see you know economic reset. And these are part of the economy. Incoming you no know, president elect also be thinking that yes, this is going to help them also to drive that economy that we need. Because when you have access to your phone and where it's going and where it's coming out, you can easily you know like I feel said in the last three all these days, you can see that the rate of uh, kidnapping has really Draw because if you kidnap me, I don't carry any money. If I want to pay you, I want to transfer from my account. You also will be very careful to do that. Mm -hmm. You know, these are things, you know, these are checking something for me. It's a welcome for all of us, both the courts, the mm -hmm. citizen, and for the bank.